G'day guys, this is a bit of a, a quick video based on the uh, 2018 setup. What I've got going. Um, as you can see, the good old trailer. It's the same trailer as before. It's all been resprayed. It's all painted up again. Uh, we've got the Tanaka 270S. Uh, that's a pretty good trimmer, put it that way. Um, also got the Gravely, 42 inch, it said TXL. It's still going like the clappers. And we've got the good old Honda 216. Uh, converted this, we changed it around. We just have the Honda 216 M2. Um, the problem is with the M2 is that the chute around here, this chute, the, the deck itself and the chute is a lot smaller, it's not as good. It's had its days, but anyway, we've um, managed to put the motor onto one of the older version Hondas, 216s. So, and the other thing is too, the Ariyama trimmer, it's the one that you've seen in the previous videos. Still goes okay, it's pretty good. It's got some power in it. Um, the unfortunate thing is this speed feed head. It's the only fault we've got with it. Uh, apparently what happens, if you're gonna change this trimmer line, you gotta actually push in there and pull this off. You gotta take it apart just to feed the, the cord through. Whereas with the older version, what I've got on the Tanaka, um, that's the older version speed feed head and that's easy you just put it through and ch 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 ratchet it up the only other thing is it is a strong machine this one the Mariana but the only problem is um, I don't feel it's as powerful as the Tanaka um, I'll go back to the Tanaka and have a look at that a look at the view pretty good up here downtown barrel yeah, the Tanaka, I mean, it's an old machine, uh, Japanese made. It's one of the older versions. And the good thing about it, it's bulletproof. And it's got so much power. Uh, I just can't work out the differences. Uh, that's the only reason I'm still using it. Uh, we did have a bit of an issue with it. Whereas he bent, uh, back the trailer into a fence and cause this is hanging out, but it's not that much hanging out. Just a little bit, I suppose, a couple of inches. Um, depending, depending on how you look at it. Maybe it's just a petrol cap. Um, yeah, bent it and uh, we had to get a new shaft. That's why we got the Murray Armour. The Murray Armour, the other issue we have with this is we'll back to the speed feed head. Uh, the good thing about it, I should say, not the, it's not the bad thing. The good thing about the speed feed head Mariama is that it tends to not go through the trimmer line so much. Uh, the original ones, like the Tanaka, yeah, it goes through it quite quick. But this, for some reason, I don't know why, it must be something to do with the mechanism, the way it's designed inside. Um, I don't know, I don't know what it is. But it just goes, goes and goes forever. And I hardly ever go through cords. So it must have some kind of a release in it there or something. I don't know. It gives, gives when the whip's doing the cord pulling. Other than that, guys, just a normal ute as normal with the toolbox, handy toolbox. Got the steel blower in there. I've got a lot of rubbish in there at the moment, so I'm not going to show you. <laughs> but anyway, guys, that's my um, 2018 setup. And that seems to be doing well. And that's what I'm going to continue with this year. Thanks for watching. Cheers.